Tom, Billy, um, first of all, congratulations on being named captain and vice captain. Um, so, firstly, what do you think about it? And then, secondly, what do you think that will entail for you guys this year? Okay. No, go on, you go first. Um, yeah, pretty chat, pretty honest to be named captain um, for the team that I've been playing for for 10 years, 10 odd years now. Um, so, very excited to get into it. I think this year will look like a bit different to last. We've definitely got a different squad, a big squad, um, a competitive squad, which will be um, really interesting to see how it progresses throughout the year. Um, but early signs are definitely strong. Nice. Really? Yeah, exciting, just echoing what Tom said and building on what we did last year. I think we wanted to finish a bit higher and I think definitely given ourselves the, the right launch pad to go on and, and you know push push higher than what we did last year and crack that top four I think is definitely an aim for us. We're pretty vocal about wanting to be a top four team and you know we've got the, the base to do it and running the right pieces and getting getting going in pre-season. You've had a bit of running going. Yeah, that was it. Awesome. So yeah, into that, uh, that subject of pre-season. So we've been in for a week now. So what can we expect over the next few weeks? What's uh, the coaches going to be putting us through? Up. To be fair, they've, they've, uh, they're very focused on the detail this year. Um, we're getting a lot of our aerobic stuff done um, outside of it, um, as well as the fitness games when we are here as well. Um, but as ever with any pre-season, you know, like, going to be struggling, the lungs are going to be out of your throat. Um, I think there's going to be plenty more of that um, throughout the rest of it. Yeah, and it's needed, we've got five, games to, five weeks to our first game, sorry, and don't have a lot of time to get boys up to speed with the detail. Luckily, we've had good retention, I think, from last year, so that'll feed through the rest of the squad that's new, but yeah, five weeks to the first one, and I think boys are really pretty excited. There's been a few, um, few flying shoulders in the touch games already, so nice. yeah, I'm excited to for it. Having lots of games in pre-season is going to be a really strong for us because we've got such a big squad now to be able to use guys that and get everyone playing, get everyone minutes into the belts. So that actually come that first game, we are ready to go. Um, you both kind of touched on it with uh, your previous answers, but I'll just say what your feelings about the squad this year. You said not too much turnover, but we've got a few new guys coming through the doors. What are your uh, what are your thoughts on that? I think it looks really strong at the moment. I think they've definitely put some good work in over the summer and in recruitment um, and it's strengthening all areas as well which is really nice to see. It's, um, it's not just one or two key positions, it's across the board. There will be competition for places mm -hmm. um, and that always just drives down as we can we can. Yeah, fair play to everyone behind the scenes putting in the recruitment effort. It's, it's not easy, it's a whole club effort. Um, the club's got so much to offer and it's brilliant to see people want to come and be a part of the journey moving forward. And then, final question, any fixtures in particular looking forward to this year, the two of you? Any ones that stand out for you on the, uh, on the calendar now we know? I think a bit similar on that. Yeah? In some fronts. It's definitely the, for me, it's definitely the, um, the local fixtures, the, the local rivalries. Yeah. Um, Richmond and Rosalind Park are the two that definitely um, spring to mind, especially as we've got them both pretty early on as, um, as well. So, um, yeah, that definitely be in the back of all of our minds, I think, to, um, throughout pre season. Yeah, Asia as well, like coming up, another London game and captain there before, so it's always a big one. Uh, so, yeah, it's awesome. Saves the journey time as well. That's awesome. Thank you, guys.